with the Go MRI Man. Spread the knowledge. Motivate the people. What's up? It's Kwame, aka MRI Man. So today we are going to be talking about my favorite MRI books. And to me, the most important books to have while being a student. So you're either a student or you are interested in MRI or you're going to get your prerequisites, but you just want to be a step ahead of the game. You came to the right place. So I'm going to get right into it. Um, from the top, man, the human body in health and disease. Human anatomy and physiology are the most important to me in MRI, man. Like, it's the core, you know? You got to know how the body functions. You got to, in relate in relations to the scan, right? This book is very detailed, and uh, let's look into it. So you start off, you have like the skeletal system, the muscular system. Look at that, you got the digestive system. The nervous system. As you see, if somebody comes in with sciatic pain, you would know that this is caused by a lower disc in the back being ruptured or maybe it's pinching a nerve. Um, so I've had patients come in and they're like, why aren't you guys scanning my leg? Why are you scanning my back? So very important to have one of my favorite books. There it is. Every MRI tech knows what this is. MRI in practice, the classic. Okay. There's probably other editions out right now. And I think we have a newer edition my wife bought somewhere around here. But look, look how beat up this book is. Um, you can tell I was, I was all about this book, right? You know, MRI in practice. This book is gonna play a huge role while you are studying for the ART or the armor test. I'm telling you, this book is gonna be your best friend. All the stuff about trade-offs and MRI physics, it's all in this book, man. It's all here. How to set parameters, what a T1 is, a T2, K space. You gotta have this book for sure. Another cool book here, CT and MRI Pathology, A Pocket Atlas. Love this book, man. So it just tells you about all the different pathology. You know, can you guys see that? Check it out. Amazing book. This is another thing you gotta have. I still refer to this book and check it out every once in a while because as a technologist, it's gonna be Great, you're gonna be a great technologist if you can identify some of these abnormalities, you know? Um, you may even save a life or get the care that they need faster. This, you might scan someone and you might see something abnormal and they need attention right away because you know what? Sometimes the radiologist doesn't read the scan right away. So I feel like, you know, it's a big responsibility um, knowing these things, you know, if you see some some kind of abnormalities here going in the spine, pushing on the spinal cord, like this this is a stat, you know, this must be read right away, you know, this, this needs attention, right? Okay, so definitely you guys need a book like this, something that tells you the MRI pathology. It's small, it's a small book, you can take it to work. Um, great, I love this book. I kept it along, it's kind of beat up. Definitely check this book out. This is like a three-part uh, series. It's This is a sectional anatomy, and this one starts off with the, the head and neck. It's CT and MRI. So this is awesome. I mean, it gets in very, very uh, detail, like with the anatomy, you know? Every structure, very detailed. Love this book helped me uh, study and learn anatomy. It's very, very detailed. So definitely you guys need something like this. You need something that's just, lets you know every little structure. I mean, it is hard to learn all this stuff and 
I don't think anyone really remembers all of the anatomy, all right? We always have to refer to a book or to Google, but I think this is a very interesting book. And it's a, it's a three-part series. That's head and neck, and then I have, a, you know, this is the thorax, heart, abdomen, and pelvis. Same thing, just really detailed anatomy here. Amazing book, cross-sectional in all planes. You gotta know your anatomy in all planes, remember that. And this is the um, spine, extremities, and joints. Definitely check this out. I love this. I love this book. These books. And this is the Big Mama sectional anatomy book right here. Also, one of those books you gotta have. Ah, this one's huge. Same thing as the little ones. Um, I would say this one is a little more like I wouldn't say basic, but. It looks like in this book, they are telling you the main structures that you should know, like the common structures here. Another great, great book. I like how, see it shows you where the, the slice is in relation to the image. See like, you see the IECs there, internal auditory canal, great book. I always refer back to it sometimes, you know. Cool. Kept this book. I'm not getting rid of this book. Uh, I even got some notes still hanging around. Definitely. This one's cool. This is kind of like a practice book. And uh, got some questions in there about sectional anatomy. And then you'll have like some arrows pointing to some some structures and you know, this is pretty cool. This was kind of like our homework at school. I think we would actually take copies of this and then, you know, do it that way. Or we can you can just write it on a piece of paper if you don't want to write in the book because you want to practice over and over, right? Practice test, you guys do need to practice. So that's a cool one, sectional anatomy. MRI scanning. I got this like right before uh, clinicals. And it's a cool little book, it's pretty basic. Um, it gave me some confidence. Kinda, it, uh, let me see, tells you like, you know, what your parameters should be for uh, you know different sequences, T1s, T2, that kind of stuff. And then it'll show you like the angles. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it kind of shows you like how your uh, slices should be for different structures, uh, different parts of the anatomy. All right, that's it guys. I hope you liked the video. Go ahead and subscribe, like, comment, and these are some of my favorite books and the books that I've kept over the last six years or so. And I think these are the core of the MRI program. These are the core essentials, okay? Anyway, good luck with you guys. Peace, love, positivity. I'm out.